right, guys, this is it. Welcome back to Hey Archer. The final Mandalorian two-minute review of season one. I'm excited. I'm I'm excited but sad to do this video. Overall, the episode was a little iffy, right? There's a lot of cool action, right? I, I will say that off the jump. The only complaint I had, this is like in the episode, was I felt when Mando was down and they and he was like telling Gina Carano to leave him and all that stuff. I feel like that was a wasted amount of time. Like he could have done without it. Uh, they also eventually they took off his mask. Uh, I ate whatever the robot's name is. Took off his mask. Uh, I was hoping there'd be like some sort of beard or something under there. Especially if he never takes the mask off. You figure he'd be really like scruffy or something. But the two takeaways of this episode, of course. Number one, interesting. They said that being a Mandalorian is not a race of people. It's a Kree. Uh, which would change a lot of what's happened in Star Wars previously, uh, especially in the Clone Wars series. Uh, but speaking of that, the Mandalorian earned his jetpack finally, but he goes up against Moff Gideon at the end, uh, takes out his TIE fighter. But but when the ship goes down, you, you kind of already know that Moff is not dead. Uh, he's going to be probably the big bad of the next season. He uses a Darksaber to get out of there. So even in the episode, they alluded to him being involved in the Mandalorian War. I mean, he even says it. Uh, so it's going to be interesting to see if they include him and how he gets the Darksaber in the new season of Clone Wars. Um, so it also kind of throws off the age. I feel like the age kind of doesn't make sense there because this takes place after Return of the Jedi and the Mandalorian War takes place years before A New Hope. But those, I mean, that was a big, big reveal, the Darksaber there. Um, of course, I always tell you guys, watch Clone Wars. It's amazing. So let's see where this show goes. Uh, let's see if any of this is shown in the Clone Wars final season that's gonna be coming out this uh, coming year. And I hope you guys enjoyed The Mandalorian with me. I'll probably do a series recap um, later on, a longer formed episode. And of course, I owe you guys kind of a long form review of The Rise of Skywalker. I was giving you time to watch the movie. So thanks again for watching. Thanks for being part of the two minute review series on The Mandalorian. I am curious to see what uh, the next two-minute reviews will be. Of course, Working Moms will make its return because there's no other shows right now for me to watch to review with you guys. So thanks, like, comment, subscribe, share the video, share the playlist. I'll see you guys in the next video.